Welcome to this week's edition of Midlife Mood Taste Test. On location. On location. We're, we're, oh, we are celebrating my mom's upcoming 75th birthday, so she was kind enough to invite us to celebrate with her, along with the rest of my family. So we're without Mabel. She couldn't make the journey with us. Sad. But yeah. she's having the time of her life with the neighbors, going for car rides and getting lots of treats. Speaking of treats, that's what we're going to have today. All right. I am so interested in trying this. Um, these are called Fasting Bar, so Intermittent Fasting Bar. I saw these at Sprouts. I'm very interested to see how they taste. They claim that it does not break your fast if you're doing intermittent fasting. I'll let you try, whoops, I'll let you try this one first. This is a lemon berry one. Lemon All berry. of these um, have similar macros, 200 to, to 210 calories, 14 carbs, eight grams of fat. So the net carbs do decrease on that and around four to five grams of protein. They claim on their website, they did a study of hundred plus people and eating these bars keep you in ketosis and do not break your fast. So I haven't read it in depth, I don't know the actual science, but that's what they claim. Fail. Oh, really? Not liking that. Sour, really sour. That's the problem. Okay, so this is the lemon berry. All yeah. right, you can try. Think about that. Try that. Blue. Okay, you will. Sour. Try. Very sour. I, I could barely have one bite of that. The lemon. Yeah. It's the lemon. And you love lemon. Yeah, I don't mind lemon at all, but that's just really, really sour. It's okay. I wouldn't eat it. I wouldn't choose this. I'm not ready to uh, try to make it special. See, this is why I come off naked a lot. It's not, it's not. Because you. It's not disgusting. Every oh, it is so awesome. I no, I'm not great. saying it's awesome, but I'm not saying it's disgusting. I don't want to spit it out. But it is a very lemon sour taste. I do love the ingredients in these. For example, this is pecans or pecans, depending on how you say it. Macadamia nuts, uh, almond flour, almond honey, flaxseed. So they're all ingredients that you know. It's nothing that you can't pronounce. It's not a bunch of artificial flavors and, and foods. Much better. Okay, so this is the blueberry acai. Yeah, much better. Just a tame down taste. Just a simple taste. Tastes like a lot of other protein bars you're gonna have and stuff like that. I would compare this to the RX bar. Have you ever had those? I don't think so. But I've had something similar to this. I don't know what it is I've had, but. It's fine, totally fine. It's I fine. That at all. I get the acai at the end. I don't get much blueberry flavor in this one though, do you? Uh, yeah, I did. You did? Okay. Unless it tastes like the acai, I have no idea what the acai tastes like. I don't know why we call it the acai anymore, but it's spelled acai, whatever. Acai, acai, potato, potato, tomato, tomato, pecan, pecan. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> There's just a lot of foods that you can call different things. Okay, this one is nuts and honey. I would expect this one to taste good. You would expect it. We like both of those. Oh, okay. Ooh, so far, initial bite, I like. Yeah, that raw, dry though. Drier than the other one. Yeah, the blueberry one was a little bit, had a little bit. Yeah, I wonder if there's no fruit or anything in it. It's, it's a lot drier than the, uh, the other two fruit ones. Yeah, nuts, nuts, nuts. Yeah. Flour, flaxseed. Yeah, that could be yeah, right. Honey. Like, they add the honey to add. But definitely, it. yeah, definitely drier than the other two, though. Uh, so far, the blueberry is still in the lead. Uh -huh. I mean. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay, we have two more. This one should be oh, good. Oh, I'm staring out of paradise. Could keep talking. <laughs> okay, here's a question Nuts and do you say cacao chips or cocoa chips? Uh, I would say cacao, I guess. I think I actually say cacao. Okay, see, we need somebody who's like an English specialist here to tell us exactly there how to go. pronounce these. I don't, it doesn't look very chocolatey. Mm -mm. Doesn't taste very chocolatey either. Mm, I don't like that one. A lot of berries coming out all of a sudden. What's that first bite? I don't. That's weird. Hmm. That's a macadamia, is that what you said? So this one, yeah. mm. almonds, first ingredient. Almonds, macadamia. I taste the macadamia more than I taste the almond. Yeah, I don't taste almond. I don't taste the chocolate. I don't like that I one. I don't taste the chocolate. Oh, you know what? 
coming in at the end, it's a dark, dark chocolate. It's not what we're expecting. Taste that dark chocolate at the end. Mm. Stuck to your teeth. I don't get it. Yeah. Um, I like the previous. I like the nuts and honey one better uh -huh. than this. Yeah, I do too. Um, okay, so so far we're still leading with blueberry. Last up, nuts and dark cacao, cocoa. Well, see, that, that that to me tastes really dark. Yeah, this is a different. So I'll be honest to see so how much darker this tastes. The main ingredients in this same. So almonds, macadamia nuts. Yeah, I got a feeling that blueberry one's gonna be the number one. For this me. one looks. It's more chocolatey. Yeah, this one definitely looks more chocolatey. We'll see. It looks like that. Better. Dry though. I get the chocolate in this one though. Yeah, it's better than that last one we just had. But it's as dry as that other peanut butter and honey mm -hmm. one or whatever we had. Oh, not a fan. All right. Okay. If you want to give the intermittent fasting bar a try, we recommend the blueberry. Yeah, I think that is the hands down winner. Then I would say the nuts and honey and then lemon. That would be my order. Those and if you're three. a person my size, be careful. These are tiny. Yes, these are tiny. And it says on their website, these are not meant to be a meal replacement. It's yeah. meant to get you through kind of that fasting period of when you wake up to when you eat your first meal. Yeah. So. It, with 200 calories, even for me, that's not a meal. Yeah. I mean, I would eat, have to eat two or three of those to yeah. maybe eat oh, yeah. full. So, okay, if you're at Sprouts and you want to buy them and try them, let us know what you think. If you guys are wondering, the sun's out, so guns are out. Mm. Yeah, piece of that. Uh, mm. Goodbye. <laughs>